welcome to your line locksmith okay we've got a job here today uh, it's just to change the cylinder for the front door uh, tenants moved out and they want new keys uh, for the front door so we will film and show you how it's done okay so the tools you need to change a front door rim cylinder you need a flathead screwdriver in this case to take those two screws off Phillips screwdriver for the inside if it's a Phillips screws side cutters and go your placement nuts you okay Roxy? Yeah. <laughs> Take them to two screws out. Oh, so the, the, yeah. Not natural. We've got two more screws here. In this case, it's got flat flat screwdrivers. So we're going to take this off. Okay, so Once you take the two holder screws off, after you finish this, the uh, cylinder will just come up. You got your new cylinder, it should come with the screws. Okay, one thing you have to do is what we call the tail. You have to cut the tail so it will fit into the, the night latch at the back. What we normally do is just match it up to the same size as the old cylinder. If you're fitting a new one, then you just refer to the manufacturer's um, guide of how long you need the, the tail. In this case, we'll just match up to the old one. And you want to get yourself one of these. This is the best side cutters I've come across. Shout out to my, one of my colleagues, one of my fellow locksmiths. Fix a lot. He recommended these. So easy to cut. That's so easy. But these are the ones. Get new cylinder. Now you got these two screws, and you just
Make sure those two screws are tight. That will hold the cylinder in place. Put your light latch. Get a new key. I can show you from the outside. It's a new lock, front door lock changed. Jump down.